some dickheads. Uh, if you hadn't fucking figured out where we are, or maybe the title of the video, uh, yeah, we're on another fucking Vape Expo vlog. We're going all the way from uh, Adelaide, South Australia, where I uh, reside, to uh, Birmingham fucking Vapor Expo October. There's two this year, remember? There's always two. As you can see, I'm in cattle class. If you ever wondered, does the Bogan get to travel stylishly in uh, business? Uh, no. No, I'm not that famous. <laughs> I got to travel business class once in 2018. Of all the expos that I've been to, of all the international trips that I've been on, only once has it been plush. The rest of the time, I'm sitting with these fuckers for the next 24 hours, 23 and a bit. Uh, we're gonna go by uh, Doha, wait around a couple of hours there, sneak in a beer, and then uh, on to fucking Heathrow. So, uh, yeah, fucking welcome to the uh, Vapor Expo October 2022 Vape Travel Block. Fucking genius. So how many AT, uh, how many 21700s? We've got 16 21700s. Right, let's, let's call it a month of vaping dickheads. I mean, there's no voltage drop or battery sag because you've got you know, a fucking power plant backing you up. It's good stuff. Everybody needs one of these, you know, if you don't want to recharge your batteries too often.
every one of you. We want to thank all of our all fucking righty dickheads. It is Sunday afternoon. It is the winding down stage of uh, Vapor Expo. They're, uh, they're throwing out the last of the freebies on the stage. The stalls are doing the last of their deals. So it's time for me fucking thoughts. And uh, as you know, my thoughts in uh, May, they weren't 100% uh, they weren't positive. A lot of disposables back then. Was not not impressed with the lack of sort of grassrootsy DIY stuff, uh, but I got to say, we're not back to 2019, 2018 levels of uh, you know DIY levels, but we are getting there. They have made progress. They have improved. They listened. I'm uh, I'm standing in the uh, the modders gallery or the coil gallery. Um, it's been awesome to see companies like Infinite Mods. All the way from uh, from Mexico, if we, if we just pan over here, we have um, we have Infinite Mods. As you guys saw a little bit of footage earlier of some of their beautiful products, it's awesome to see a company like that back here in the UK. Uh, we got Overkill Mods doing their ridiculous oversized stab wood mods and 3D printed mods. A uh, thousand twenty-one seven hundred batteries in a single mod. Um, we've got a bunch of coilers from uh, all over the UK here and, uh, and quite a bit of juice as well. And, you know, in, in 2018, I would have said, oh, whatever bit of juice, where's all the hardware? But these days, when you see juice instead of a disposable, it kind of makes you a little happy. So, uh, <laughs> yeah, we're making the best of it, dickheads. We've got more juice. We've had some, uh, some nice additions of coils and mods. Uh, and they have made progress. They listened and they have made a little progress. As I said, we've got, we've got a way to go before we're back to uh, the days of old. But it's certainly uh, a, a step in the right, I think, I, think, I think a step in the right direction sums up uh, my thoughts on Vapor Expo October 22. Uh, a step in the right direction. A lot of disposables, that's to be expected, they're everywhere. But at least they listened and they got a bit more you know, grassrootsy stuff, and uh, you know, dodging cars, and a sideshow ride. Uh, it's not bait related, but hey, it's not a disposable. I'll take a fucking sideshow ride over a disposable stand. So, a step in the right direction is, I think, what I have to say on um, on this October Vapor Expo. So, uh, with that being said, dickheads, I think it's about time that I uh, fucked off. So, fucking thanks for watching, and I uh, hope you enjoyed the vlog. Cheery fucking oh.